up E Lesson Book, page 32, more about the C major scale. We learned about the tetrachords making a scale. Left hand has the lower tetrachord, right hand has the upper tetrachord with the thumbs tucked underneath. I count and we play. One, two, ready, go. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. You can play the ascending C major scale with the left hand only by crossing three over one, like this. One, two, ready, go. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. You can play the descending C major scale with the right hand only by crossing three over one, like this. One, two, ready, go. C, B, A, G, F, E, D, C. C, B, A, G, F, E, D, C. Now we can do that C major scale right hand followed by left hand, like this. C, B, A, G, F, E, D, C. C, B, A, G, F, E, D, C. C, B, G, E, F, G, A, B, C. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. If you're really brave and you're really strong, you can try putting those hands together. This is called contrary motion. The fingers are the same, the cross happens at the same time, but the letter names will be different because our hands are in mirror image. So we're gonna go much slower this time. I'm gonna count one, two, three, four, one, two, ready, go. Cross three, leap out. You can also play this contrary motion scale starting with the thumbs on middle C and going out. This is much harder because that means that the thumbs have to cross underneath the threes like this. Cross under. Come back to middle C. Cross under. can combine those contrary motion scales by starting at middle C, going out to the outside C's and coming back in. Both directions are called contrary motion. Anytime the hands are going apart or going towards, that's called contrary motion. Let's try. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, cross. One, two, three, four, Five, come back in. Four, three, two, one. Cross three, two, one. Let's try that again. Ready? One, two, ready, go. One, two, three. Cross one, two, three, four, five. Come back. Four, three, two, one. Cross three, two, one. Well done.